Hey guys, we see here two trucks. Uh, somebody didn't let too much space between them and uh, they got messed up. You see like the left truck, it's all the way in the left and the right truck, it's all the way in the right. But the problem is like when you go on our right now in the back, we see this, I'm not sure where's the truck who hit the truck in the back or how that goes, but somebody, the second the red truck which you see over there, hit I think the both trucks. How is that even possible on the Arkansas bridge on the 55S? Uh, I don't even know. I think it took like a couple hours to unhook them from each other and go to the cone and get stuff like that. But yeah, it's kind of bad. This is why guys don't never stay in your homes. Never stay in your homes. Uh, now we see a really unexperienced driver who is uh, want to try to make a left turn. That it's a super bad idea. So first of all, it's super tight and it's going on the angle. I think it's like six, seven percent uh, downhill over there and uh, the trailer start uh, touching the ground. If you see the truck stopped and he doesn't really know what to do right now, right? And uh, he's still sitting there and thinking what kind of mess he did because the down, if you see in the trailer, that two pieces of aerodynamics are gonna go bad and they cost like around $6,000. And you see now how the truck, the pickup truck don't give a hell about problems of another guys and just passing by <laughs> like how it's supposed to. And the second car also doesn't care. And the driver's trying to lift the trailer or unlift it. I think it's more likely he tried to unlift the um, tra the trailer um, to move it. I didn't think he successfully did that. Um, this was 100% a thrown in case. And just to move this truck was gonna cost it between two thousand and a half to five thousand dollars depends how far they are from the cloning company <sighs> and guess who gonna supposed to pay for that mistake <laughs> uh, the best scenario would be half and a half with the driver and the truck in company we'll see how they're gonna go you see the guys how uh, the truck uh, the, dri the, the driver just regular car drive it and see how that big rig messing up is going all the way on the bottom of the hill and good luck he didn't hit no people i think um, yeah he's damaged right a car right now ah, damn. that'll cost a lot of money to do that fixing um from the second first of all suspension you want to see the the car i'm not sure how they pass them and uh, i think he hit some boring or an animal and lost the control of the of the truck because the wheels is just locked or something like that and uh, you cannot do nothing with uh, 80,000 pounds uh, I guess the driver at least saved some lives that's a hundred percent yeah the truck will be more likely total uh, hopefully the load is not total I think not really because it's a uh, some moving company i think the load will be okay because they safety secure that on the rest uh, we're gonna know the story we'll see uh, how that ends up and again any second you stay on the side you do a look on your phone you're gonna see trouble happening all the time in the road because everything is moving around you you're moving and everybody need to go somewhere to be somewhere and do something <music>